Today we have a Volvo S80 2.5 turbo for cleaning. We will show you the entire cleaning process from A to Z. First of all, let's connect the computer and look for errors in the engine and in all the blocks that the device finds. We found a few errors, but they are in the transmission block and in the ABS. Let's make a report on them. Now all errors have been removed and all systems are in a normal position. Now let's connect our hose to the air intake after the air intake in front of the turbine. We'll connect a vibration sensor in case the engine stalls during cleaning. As we remember, in this case our gas supply will be turned off. We have already started the engine, now let's start the cleaning system. The hose is connected, the vibration sensor is working, it shows that the system sees the engine running, so we start the cleaning process. We set the time. For 2.5 liters it will take us one hour. We press start, and that's it, our timer went off. Here we have a meter for the volume of gas that enters the car. During these 60 minutes, we will process 2,200 liters of gas. As you can see, when cleaning, gasoline cars do not behave very consistently. The revolutions may fluctuate. I would like to say that we carry out cleaning by enriching the standard fuel-air mixture with Brown's gas, HHO. While the car is being cleaned, we will ozonate the interior. We put it in the car and close it for 10 minutes. Here you can see white smoke. Great! Thank you! We don't see any black chunks or soot. This means all the carbon deposits have burned and come out as condensate. In this case, only the soot formed in the exhaust tract itself comes out. The cleaning process lasted one hour, after which we gassed the car to properly remove the remaining burnt carbon deposits. After cleaning, it is also recommended to drive the car a little so that the car can clean itself for some time. If the car was not cleaned at low mileage, as dealers recommend, then the carbon deposits will not be removed the first time. As a rule, one cleaning cycle can remove up to 80% of carbon deposits. Since the procedure is safe, it can be repeated after 300-400 kilometers to improve and consolidate the results. Finally, the car is assembled. The final step is to recheck through the computer for possible errors. Since the machine behaved unstable during cleaning, I expected some errors in the system. But fortunately, I did not find any. Everything's all right here. 